Hey everybody, welcome back. We're talking to you all, Ron, and we have a special episode where he's going to be playing some of the themes from his album, um, which is entitled Four Divine States of Mind. And he there are four themes, loving kindness, compassion, vicarious joy, equanimity, and these are four, from the four divine teachings from Buddhism. So uh, we're going to, I want to talk about loving kindness. So you had said that um, in the actual album that you'll be listening to, that people can p find in Spotify all over the place. Just type in four divine states of, of, of um, mind and you'll be able to listen to the music. But the first one you said is loving kindness where you have um, a ch children's choir from LA. Um, and you told a little bit about the genesis of this idea, but when, when you yourself was coming up with the theme because you were composing the music, what, as a songwriter, what did you tune into when you're thinking, okay, I'm, I'm hired to think about these four divine teachings, loving kindness. Um, what were you thinking of when you came up with the theme? Well, with loving kindness, I thought about the mother, motherly love. I mm -hmm. thought about the incredible, incredible uh, love of the womb, mm. you know, beyond the mother, you know, within the mother, there's a womb that protects the, the, the little fetus, you know, the little life that's starting. There's this quality of the womb and how warm, the warmness and the unconditionality of this love, it's love that is always there, that it's not on any conditions, uh, no matter what the fetus does, the womb protects it. And mm. uh, so it's life and it's the love to life you know before there are opinions before there are religions and ethnicity and anything that quality of love of the womb and the motherly love that mother can sacrifice herself for a child there's, there's all kinds of stories about how mothers walked miles and miles and miles um, to bring their sick baby to a hospital, let's mm. say that is three days walk, you know, from the village. Recently, I heard about one of the, these stories and the mother sacrificed her life on that mm. journey to bring the child that was sick to the hospital. And um, that kind of incredible giving, it's 100% giving. And it's a very warm and round sound in my head. I, I heard this round and warm sound. Mm. So if you'd like, I'll, I'll play you the theme. Mm. So this is called Aham Purma, loving kindness. The, the, the mantra chanting that I chose is called Aham Purma. That's what the singer sings. Aham it's Purma. I am divine love. Aham mm. Purma in Sanskrit. Mm. So the melody, the thing that I came up with was like this. I'm sorry, this is Chloe. And Chloe Pumoradi sings it on the album. Thank you. the theme that came mm. out of me and mm. then I fitted the words and then Chloe sang it with the Sanskrit words and it all came together mm. all right so let's um, cover the next one compassion and you had said that um, it was flamingo gypsy singer um, Granada what was her name yeah her name is Estrella Morente from Granada in Spain, in Andalusia. And she's considered now the voice of Andalusia. Mm. She's an incredible singer, Estrella Morente. So she, sing, she sang that song. And uh, I remember I was sitting in my 
a dining table one day with my Una, I was thinking about compassion, and this is what came out of, of this. Um, <laughs> heaviness and darkness and but feeling you know feeling when you encounter suffering in the world that feeling that we want to cultivate is embrace and and feeling the pain you know mm. so not we're not um having this block this elephant skin that we don't feel anything when we see, you know, when you see a homeless in the street laying down, mm. so so we don't lose the feeling of pain mm -hmm. because the person on the on the sidewalk there must be in pain, you know. So that's what compassion for me. So that's the theme that came out of that. Mm. And, and what was the mantra that was? Um, the mantra, the mantra for that, and the, and I didn't play it yet. I'll play it for you too. But the mantra goes, "Om Mani Padme Hum." Oh, okay. Om Mani Padme Hum, which is considered the mantra for the Bodhisattva of compassion. And um, it's incredible when you hear the children sing that, "Om Mani Padme Hum." Mm. It's so sweet in the with their voices, just. Amazing. So the the melody of the mantra chanting for the compassion song goes like this. <laughs> social media to bring more positivity and less negativity in social media it's called four divine practices it's okay. a hashtag for the number four four divine practices all one word hashtag and we invite people around the world to chant and meditate and do any kind of work with this music and to post videos of them doing something you know meditating doing yoga, chanting along, something with this positive mm -hmm. music. And we're getting, uh, and, and it goes all the way to the end of December. And, you know, it's kind of a, a kind of a competition without an award. It's just a, like inviting people to participate. And, mm -hmm. and we're going to post, you know, what people are doing that, and that they wish to post on, on social media. So, for example, there's a choreographer named jo Georgina from Los, Los Angeles, uh, and she went to the ocean, she went to the beach with the music, she brought speakers and all, and she played the Loving Kindness song, Loving mm. Kindness. She played it on the beach and she went into the waves and, and made a dance and she filmed it. And so we put it, put it on social media as an example of expression of loving kindness. So. People are now participating, and that's what we want: is to people to output 
positive messages with those videos and, and showing themselves meditating or chanting or doing yoga or anything they, they come up with, with this message. With that mm, lovely. So how would I go to your Facebook site? Where is it to? Uh, it's on Meta Mindfulness Music. A face, Facebook page and Meta is with double T. Meta Mindfulness Music. You can also just do hash, hashtag for divine the, practice. The, yeah, the practices. Practices. For, for divine practices as a hashtag, and then it it goes to that page on the website. Lovely. Okay, so we've been talking Nouvel One and we've listened to two and in the next segment we'll talk about the other two. We were talking about loving kindness and compassion and um, how the mastermind behind writing this music, how it was composed and produced. And so in the next segment we're going to talk about vicarious joy and equanimity and um, and also don't forget for, hashtag for divine practices or Meta, M-E-T-T-A, Mindfulness Music that you can find on Facebook. Thank you so much.